Be me two weeks ago. Out at the dear lease with my friend. He says hey and I'm gonna head on out. I'm bummed because it's only 5 p.m. and we were supposed to spend the rest of the night out there. 10 for dude, catch you later. He leaves the blind and heads off through the woods towards the trucks. About 40 minutes later I hear a tapping on the door. Look out the slide on the door. It's my buddy, he doesn't say shit so I just let him in. Thought you were heading out man, you weren't gonna quit on me. Notice he doesn't have his rifle. Where's your gun dude? Oh, left it at the truck. Oh well. Shit you may as well have gone home high. He just smiles and sat there, didn't say a word. Except for the occasional grunt of acknowledgement and hum of interest. It weirds me out because he's normally a pretty social guy. Always talking about UFC shit or Mass Effect. I ask you okay bro. All he says is don't feel good, that's all. About 5.30 am he says hey Annan, I'm gonna head on out. Before I can even reply he's gotten up and exited the blind and I can hear him tromping through the woods. At the time I thought, well thanks for scaring off the deer fuckwit. But now that I think about it he wasn't walking towards the trucks, he was walking kind of off the way. About 7 am I decide fuck it I give up. Pack my shit and head to my truck. His truck is gone so I think nothing of it. The reason I'm bringing this up is I talked to him earlier today. And was asking if he felt better and he looked at me confused and said what do you mean Anna? You know, after you came back to the blind you said you weren't feeling good. Figured that's why you weren't running your mouth about quatrain pussy. He looked at me like I grew a second head and said Anna. Dude, I didn't come back to the blind. I drove home, got home at 8 and went the fuck to bed. So yeah.